It's Thursday, November 2nd. Um, and so this is one of those days that uh, I'm my own worst enemy. So I've been writing the press release that we're going to do for our, our launch. We decided December 5th is our date. And so I've been trying to, like, we're going to send that out to news outlets. And some will pick it up, some won't. It's a good, good week to do it, right? Um, but when I write anything, I first write versions of it that make me laugh, right? And they're just, they're just horrible, right? Because I hate, like, every press release starts with, uh, we're excited to announce. Yeah, so what? You're excited? Nobody else gets a crap. Shut up. Uh, so, like, I do, like, 50 versions of things that just make me laugh but make no sense. Don't give the right information. Just, uh, uh, it's so... It is so painful sometimes to be stupid and have to write the serious stuff. Um... Sometimes, like on the Portal series in, in particular, I remember we would we would have to write these things, and it would be a whole day of us just making each other laugh before we actually wrote the really kind of boring one. They never boring, right? You want to have still a good feel to it. You want to nail it, but also you want to give a bunch of information. And often that's the way you got to act like you're a grown up, and you got to be like, yeah, I'm not going to make this as funny because it loses its information here. <sighs> but I always hate it a little bit because I always just want to be like, yeah, I just kind of want to say screw it all. Ah, but this is the time saying screw it all kind of works against you. So, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, but that is kind of like the, the weird back and forth of somebody who does, like, uh, writing, but then also writes marketing stuff. I, I always go back and forth because it's, is this entertaining or this is boring? Would I read this past this? Um, you know, I always just kind of want to make it snappy, clean, and short, but that doesn't really give enough information and nobody knows about us. So we should add some more information. Um... I have to quote myself, I have to say nice things about myself, like it's all this awkward stuff, right? Which is why often it's like helpful to do it in a group or I always attribute quotes um, to other people because then you could be nicer. Like if you've ever read a press release and you see my name in a Valve quote, like so often for Valve press releases, if you see my name in it, like especially for some piece of hardware from some random vendor that we're working with, trust me, I did not write that quote. Uh, somebody is just like, yeah, we can get Chet to say this. He'll agree to it. Uh, cause you just need to say something super positive about the thing and you're like, eh, whatever. Uh, and so yeah, that's how that stuff happens. That happens all the time in big companies. Everyone writes your quotes. Shoot, man, for, for other games, I won't say cause I really like the people I work with. I, I wrote their interviews, right? Sometimes cause you want to, you want to be funny um, and you want to carry it, right? It's all, you gotta remember that. It's all kind of presentation and it's all structured. Um, which is why making these videos are really weird because you're not supposed to talk about this kind of stuff. You're supposed to be quiet about it, right? But like whenever you see those interviews and like someone's giving snappy answers back and stuff, half the time they were told what the questions were going to be before the interview and now they're just feeding it back. Uh, you can tell when they're going just off the cuff because that's, that's when it gets dark and weird. At least it did for me. Um, but so yeah, yeah, we're in that season for the next month where uh, I got some podcasts set up you do podcasts or do YouTube stuff, if you do a tiny channel, if you do a tiny channel, I'm happy to do it. I'm happy. If you do three people, I once did, I once did an interview where a guy's mom sat in with it, uh, because he was so young and didn't know what he was doing. And I'm like, dude, that's cool. Like, well, let's go. I'll help. Um, like I, 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 I totally love that. Um, seeing people starting out and trying. Um, so if you are, you're not bugging me, uh, you can hit me up. Uh, and I'm just gonna go back now to uh, writing. Uh, I can do card tricks though. Uh, uh, writing my emotes, or not my emotes, my uh, press release here. Uh, but it's why you also hire somebody who was an editor at magazines, because I'll give this to Will Smith, and I'll be like, yeah, and he'll be like, he'll make it sound nice and not so stupid. Um, yeah, man, man. This is the part of writing. Yeah, I got good can. I like it though. I kind of like this part of the writing too. Developed by the creative leader. No, like, yeah. yeah. Saying nice stuff about yourself is always hard. Unless, I think if it's not, you're a psychopath. It'd probably be good to be a psychopath sometimes.